What is Nipah virus? Nipah virus is a zoonotic virus, it is transmitted from animals to humans. And can also be transmitted through contaminated food or directly between people. In infected people, it causes a range of illnesses from asymptomatic infection to acute respiratory illness and fatal encephalitis. Nipah virus has caused a few known outbreaks in Asia. It infects a wide range of animals and causes severe disease and death in people, making it a public health concern. Natural Host, Fruit Bats Fruit bats of the family Teropididae, particularly species belonging to the Teropus genus, are the natural hosts for Nipah virus. African fruit bats of the genus Idolan, family Teropididae, were found positive for antibodies against Nipah indicating that these viruses might be present within the geographic distribution of Teropididae bats in Africa. Nipah virus in domestic animals. Outbreaks of the Nipah virus in pigs and other domestic animals such as horses, goats, sheep, cats and dogs were first reported during the initial Malaysian outbreak in 1999. The virus is highly contagious in pigs. Pigs are infectious during the incubation period, which lasts from 4 to 14 days. Past Outbreaks Nipah virus was first recognized in 1999 during an outbreak among pig farmers in Malaysia. No new outbreaks have been reported in Malaysia since 1999. It was also recognized in Bangladesh in 2001 and nearly annual outbreaks have occurred in that country since. The disease has also been identified periodically in eastern India. Transmission During the first recognized outbreak in Malaysia, which also affected Singapore, most human infections resulted from direct contact with sick pigs or their contaminated tissues. In subsequent outbreaks in Bangladesh and India, Consumption of fruits or fruit products contaminated with urine or saliva from infected fruit bats was the most likely source of infection. Human-to-human -human transmission of Nipah virus has also been reported among family and caregivers of infected patients. Signs and Symptoms Human infections range from asymptomatic infection to acute respiratory infection and fatal encephalitis. Infected people initially develop symptoms including fever, headaches, myalgia, vomiting and sore throat. This can be followed by dizziness, drowsiness, altered consciousness, and neurological signs that indicate acute encephalitis. Some people can also experience atypical pneumonia and severe respiratory problems, including acute respiratory distress. Encephalitis and seizures occur in severe cases, progressing to coma within 24 to 48 hours. The incubation period is believed to range from 4 to 14 days. However, an incubation period as long as 45 days has been reported. Most people who survive acute encephalitis make a full recovery. But long-term neurologic conditions have been reported in survivors. Diagnosis. Initial signs and symptoms of Nipah virus infection are nonspecific. And the diagnosis is often not suspected at the time of presentation. Nipah virus infection can be diagnosed with clinical history. During the acute and convalescent phase of the disease. The main tests used are real-time polymerase chain reaction from bodily fluids and antibody detection via enzyme-linked immunosorbent assay. Treatment. There are currently no drugs or vaccines specific for Nipah virus infection. Intensive supportive care is recommended to treat severe respiratory and neurologic complications. In the absence of a vaccine, the only way to reduce or prevent infection in people is by raising awareness of the risk factors and educating people about the measures they can take to reduce exposure to the Nipah virus.